Those kids, when I open the door, I don't have to. I don't have to tell them the ritual. They've been here. They start singing "Happy Birthday." Rowan Hill is 76. She'll be 77 on Halloween, and for the past few decades, she's created a tradition to celebrate both. I have had uh, trick or treaters coming to my house for the last 43 years uh, at this house and I make popcorn balls. So when you come to my house, you sing happy birthday instead of trick or treat. If you don't sing happy birthday to me, then you have to have a piece of candy because I only give popcorn balls to the singers. That's right, popcorn balls. Well, I fill a bag with 25 popcorn balls. I tie a little knot in it and set it on the bed. Each one of these sacks has 25 popcorn balls in it. Joining her in her annual celebration is her husband, Walter. He's retired from the Santa Fe Railroad, and he's happy to see Roanne happy. And she works hard making them popcorn balls. Uh, she makes a mess. I help her clean it up, but about 125, somewhere around there. Walter likes to get up. He, he dresses in his garb and he sits out there. We have a weeping mulberry tree. And he likes to jump out of the weeping mulberry tree. Their neighbors agree. The Hills know how to do the birthday Halloween thing. Yeah, well, it's her birthday, and so everybody that goes to her house goes for the popcorn balls, but they have to sing happy birthday to her before they get one, and so they do. And they've been doing it for a long time. But you'd be surprised how many people knock on my door and tell me that they used to live down the block and this is their grandchild that they're bringing to my house. What fun that is! I'm just thinking about how much fun it is to be a kiddo and how people don't appreciate their youth until they're old. So if you're young, you better appreciate what you have because uh, if you live long enough, you're going to be old and uh, my birthday just helps me be young every year. I just have a blast and I think the people that come to my house have a blast too. Celebrating the Panhandle spirit, Larry Lemons, Pro News 7. <laughs>